Welcome to Atlas's CWI Part B exam preparation video. In this video, we're going to show you the different course materials that we present to you. And we're going to have discussions about the book of specifications, replicas, and measuring devices. Uh, we'll show you the audio flashcards and talk about our practice quizzes and simulated exams. And with all of our online courses, this is available anywhere, anytime on any of your supported devices. Our CWI courses are complete curriculums designed to aid you in taking and passing the CWI exam and receive your certification. These are not just pre-seminar courses that would prepare you to take a course, but our courses are complete courses that prepare you to take the exam. Our CWI Part A, B, and C courses are AWS accredited for 20 hours each, and you can accumulate a total of 60 hours if you take all three parts. AWS accepts these hours for either retesting purposes or as professional development hours towards a nine-year renewal. Please visit aws.org certification for further details. The Part B exam prep materials consist of four different sets of study materials. The first is the book of specifications, replicas, and tools, audio flashcards, practice quizzes, and timed exams. When you go to take your Part B practical exam, one of the sets of materials they're going to give you is the book of specifications. Now, this isn't a real book of specs. It's only used for the practical exam. So in the narrated lessons, we're going to take you through the BOS and show you the content and the organization so that you're familiar with it when you go to take your exam. This is a typical page out of the book of specifications that we'll review for you going through the narrated lesson. Annexes 7 and 8 in the Book of Specification contains two important pieces of documentation, the PQRs and the WPSs. We have one dedicated narrated lesson that will discuss the use of both of these two forms. In addition to the uh, dedicated lesson for the WPSs and the PQRs, we also have several quiz questions that will show you the proper use of these two forms. We understand that one of the biggest issues people have when they go to take the Part B practical exam is the use of replicas. Throughout our study materials, we use the current replicas so that when you go to take your exam, you're comfortable and familiar with them. We use pictures like this throughout the Part B study material so you become familiar with how measuring devices work with the current replicas. And we also use these types of pictures throughout our quiz question and answer so you can be very familiar with how to use the tools. So we believe if you study the narrated lessons and get proficient at taking the practice quizzes and do well in your timed exams, that you'd be prepared to pass your Part B practical. And now we'll take a quick look at the audio flashcards. The Part B audio flashcards includes approximately three hours of narrated flashcards. And that includes about 275 narrated questions and answers that are organized into six groups that last about 30 minutes each. The audio flashcards will always display the question on the top of the screen and once it's read it'll then uh, reveal the answer at the bottom so here's the actual narrated flashcard PQR shall list blank values of the variables used the PQR shall list actual values of the variables used you always have the option of listening to the audio flashcard on your device's audio however if you can't do that you still always have the option to manually navigate through the questions and just read the questions and answers as you go along. So the question is, the deletion of backing using a welder's qualification test blank will require the requalification of the welder. The flashcards were developed from the same databank that contains all of our questions for our quizzes and our exams. 
So it's a great way to review the information that you've already been learning. So our last example here in this flashcard, in pipeline, the completed weld shall blank. I'll have all slag removed. And now we'll take a look at our third set of prep materials, practice quizzes. Here's a quiz question that uses a picture that shows you how to take a bevel angle measurement. You can click on it to expand it and see the details. And once you've made your selection, you'll get the immediate feedback on whether you got the answer correct or not. In this instance, the immediate feedback will provide you not only the answer, but it'll also give you the formula determining how the answer was derived. The Part B practice quiz contains 275 questions that covers the book of specifications, replicas, and measuring devices. This particular quiz question, when it shows the immediate feedback, it will give you not only the answer, but the specific paragraph and the actual code verbiage. Our practice quiz questions are representative of the types of questions that you'll receive on your CWI exam. So practice them often and study them well. The better you do with the quizzes, the better you'll do overall on your exam. Now I'm going to show you the difference between timed exams and practice quizzes. For the timed exams, they're always limited to 120 minutes to replicate the length of the CWI exam, whereas quizzes are not timed. In the exam, you don't get the immediate feedback, but you'll get the results at the end of the exam. In the quizzes, as I showed you earlier, you get the immediate feedback whenever you submit your answer. The exams are scored so you can track how well you're doing, and quizzes are never scored. And for the exam, each time you take an exam, it will randomly pull 150 questions for you. In the quizzes, you have access to all 700 questions across our quiz files. You have two options if you want the narrated lessons and everything else. You can purchase the complete CWI course package, which includes all parts A, B, and C, or you can just do the individual course package where you select whether you want A, B, or C. Now that's if you want narrated lessons and everything else. If you just want the flashcards, quizzes, and exams, and you aren't interested in the narrated lessons, you can then purchase the practice package only and select which parts you want, A, B, or C, or all three. On behalf of Anna McLeod, I want to thank you for watching this video. And please contact us for any of your CWI or API training needs, whether it's online or on site. You can visit us at atlasapitraining.com. Thank you.